Hello everyone and welcome back to my walkthrough of VVV VVV also known as V6 also known as V Anyway, quick save here we are after getting the trinkets of evilness Let's continue Oh I forgot that was there right in the gap there we go and through the hole Use the treadmills to speed up. It's very helpful. And yeah, you remember this room, right? Do you remember that room? I'm sure you do, hopefully. Uh, this right here is actually a platform that moves. And what's this say? I wonder if the generator we set up in the polar dimension is what's affecting our teleporter. Nah, it's probably just a glitch. Hmm. Okay. By the way, in case you didn't realize, this room here gave you a preview of that corner there, so it's not like they're uh, cheap enough here to make you fall in the spikes or something like that. Okay, oh! I was hasty. <laughs> Alright, simple stitching. Oh, this one! Um, this is a really interesting trinket to get. Um, if you want this, you absolutely cannot hit any checkpoints up until you get back to this room. You'll see why. So all checkpoints, consider them a obstacle more than anything. You'll see why once I get to the spots. Okay, flip here, flip here, and go down here. Now careful, 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 okay. Now watch this. See that? Now we got a platform on the other side. But of course, if we leave the room, this room's gonna reset. So, how do you get that trinket while keeping that platform going? Like this. Is that not the most diabolical thing you've ever seen? <laughs> well, maybe it's not the most diabolical thing, but that's really, really tricky. Anyway, now you gotta go through the rooms again, but this time you can hit checkpoints happily. <laughs> yeah, that's that's quite the little tricky room, I have to say. <laughs> I should say, set of rooms, I have to say. Alright, now I can go through this normally. Hey, how's it going? Ah, Viridian. You got off the ship alright, too? It's good to see you, alright, Professor. Is the ship okay? <clears throat> ah, mucus. It's badly damaged, but Violet's been working on fixing it. We could really use your help. Ah, of course. The background interference in this dimension prevented the ship from finding a teleporter when we crashed. We've all been teleported to different locations. Uh, yeah, it sounds about right. Let's get back to the ship then. After you, Captain. Alright, going forward. Level complete! One to go. Or is the level complete? Uh oh. Not again. Vitillary, where are you? Captain! Hang on, I'll save you! Well. Uh oh. Uh oh. We are warping between the edges of the screen. This is craziness. Okay, now we're following him. We are- oh no, the Gravitron! The Gravitron! This isn't pretty. This is not pretty. Gotta dodge the squares or diamonds while being bounced from side to side. You get checkpoints every, I think it's like five seconds or so. But that doesn't make it all- oh! oh yeah, I think it's every five seconds or so. But it's still very difficult to survive. Even five seconds. <laughs> no! Especially when the patterns get much more difficult. But you have unlimited tries, of course. Okay, oh! Okay, checkpoint. Good checkpoint. I appreciate that. Another checkpoint. Just watch ahead on the side of the screen where the arrows are. And you'll be able to. Ooh! Start predicting. I mean, you'll be able to predict where they're coming from. Ow! <laughs> It's still a matter of timing. Oh, oh boy! Oh, ow. Checkpoint good. <laughs> oh no, pears. Not the fruits either. Pears of death. Oh. 
Oh, 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 dang it. Gotta get between. Like, oh, no, I forgot about the play when you touch the gravity reverser thingy. Okay, okay, checkpoint. Ooh, jeez. I don't, I don't know if the patterns are always the same or if there's like set um, kinds of patterns, but ow. Yes, ow is the solution to this. But what I mean is that uh, I don't know if you can actually like predict this every time. Oh, I made it. Goodbye, Gravitron. Goodbye, Gravitron. That was interesting, wasn't it? I feel dizzy. <laughs> yeah, all right. Oh wait, what? Oh, oh, I didn't touch the teleporter, of course. <laughs> now the level is officially complete. There we go. All right, let's see what the peeps have to say now that peeps are rescued. We found the Professor Vitaler. All right, we have this interference thing worked out in no time now. Sweet. I think it's no coincidence that the teleporter was drawn to that dimension. There's something there. I think it might be causing the interference that's stopping us from leaving. Hmm. Hmm. Only a few trinkets left. Captain, come on. Come and have a look at what I've been working on. It looks like these shiny things are giving off a strange energy reading, so I analyzed it. And I was able to find more of them with the ship's scanner. As you can see, the remaining ones are in places that I haven't been yet. Which is good, because that means that I've collected everything up to this point. If you get a chance, it might be worth finding the rest of them. Don't put yourself in any danger, though. Oh no, I, I would never do that. That's, you know, just for a trinket. That's just crazy. <laughs> Merlion called in to say hello. He's really looking forward to helping you find Verdidrish. I'm glad Professor Vitellier is okay. He had lots of questions for me about this dimension. He's already got to work with his research. Mm, doctor, something strange was happening when we were teleported back to the ship. We were getting brought to another weird dimension. Oh no! Maybe the dimension has something to do with the interference that caused us to crash here. Mm, there's definitely something strange happening. If only we could find the source of that interference. And I should really talk to more of these. I should I mean I should talk to them more. I hope Redigerus is all right. If you can find him, he'd be a big help fixing the ship. Sounds like everyone's a good help. I mean, a big help fixing the ship and fixing stuff and. Man, there's a lot of things going wrong here, isn't there? <laughs> Artillery is back then? You'd find him? I mean, I admit I was very worried that you wouldn't, or that someone might something might have happened to him. <laughs> Dr. Victoria? He's okay? Oh, oh, sorry, I was just thinking about what he was, wasn't it? Thank you, Captain. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I wish he wasn't so reckless. He'll get himself into trouble. Wow, how much dialogue do you have? <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Okay, I think I'm done. <laughs> okay, let's try you again. It's good to be back. I've got so much work to catch up on. Captain, have you noticed that this dimension seems to wrap around? Yeah, that's strange. It looks like this dimension is having the same stability problems as our own. But we're not the ones causing it. What? Do you think we might be? Oh, no, no, no. It's very unlikely. Really? <laughs> My guess is that whoever used, the used to live here was experimenting with ways to stop the dimension from collapsing. It would explain why they've wrapped the edges. Hmm, maybe that's what's causing the interference. I wonder where the people who used to live here have gone. They're, probably they are in the spikes of that one trinket area. <laughs> this isn't like any other dimension we've been to, Captain. There's something strange about this place. I'm making some fantastic, uh, fascinating discoveries, Captain. Good, what are they? This isn't like any other dimension. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Some very strange. Yes, you can because you can flip cap. I mean, flip the uh, flip gravity. I don't know. <laughs> hmm. Okay, I think he's done. You. I just kind of merged with your body. Don't worry, sir. We'll find a way out of here. I don't know how we're going to ship work. Oh, this is repeating dialogue, isn't it? Oh, okay, let's just get out of here. <laughs> uh, where should we go next? I'm thinking. To the upper left corner, I think, is the last area that we haven't visited yet. So, let's go! Whee! We're getting closer. Wait, um. I gotta flip when I touch the bottom and then go straight up, I think. Uh, hold on, I just wanna. a little bit further up. Uh, okay, here we go. Hey, so you weren't here before. Remember I was here, but he wasn't here before? Well, that's because I rescued him. Hey, hi, Captain. So he looks a little dangerous. Um, that's it? Okay. Uh, 
Uh, gotta check all the rooms, if at all possible. Okay, 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 don't need that checkpoint, I think. Alright, it's going around. And... Oh! Whoop! Whoop! Oh yeah, I gotta zigzag back the other way. Cheapo depo. <laughs> and, uh, mm, oh. I love that this game is... It has cheapness to it, but it, they, it, the game knows it's cheap. So it gives you a lot of checkpoints. <laughs> ah, I gotta be very touchy with my D-pad. Gotta just, like, tap it. Uh, come on, this isn't that difficult. I've been through many Vidi Vici. <laughs> okay. Um, shrink it. There we go. Voila. Another one is mine. Mine. Wow. <laughs> now let's take the other path. Because the other path is where it leads to yet another captain, and also probably one of the trickiest areas in the game. Um, uh, oh wait, it's, uh, it's wait, it's not this way, but there's a teleporter up here. I'll, I'll uh, activate that. Research notes: with just a small modification to the usual usual, rah, usual perimeters, we were able to stabilize an infinite tunnel. Oh, I've already found this. What? Game saved. All right, let's go back. And now, what I want to do is, instead of uh, going straight up, I'm going to jump off this way. Because there's another section here. It flips around to the other side of the screen. Now, if you go down through here, look at this. Look at that. Look at that. You can see inside the secret lab. But you can't actually go in there. <laughs> at least not yet. Okay, where was the platform? Okay, there's a platform. Alright, going down, just hold left. Alright, now, get ready. It's teleporter time. Now we're way, way down here for some reason, somehow. <laughs> uh, oh wait, should I have come here? I, I guess I could always go back and get trinkets. But I kind of missed some spots um, a little bit northwest from here to activate on the map. Oh, poopers. Well, hmm. Yeah, I could always do that later, I suppose. Let's just go around, and... Oh yeah, you gotta get to the center, don't you? Yeah! So that was the opening that I needed to get into. So, in we go! And... It's around... Teleports! Teleports! We're not in, like, a level of sorts, but it's more like a... A maze, I guess you could say. Whee! And it'll eventually lead to... Things that we need. It's, it's pretty confusing, but it's actually pretty linear. I mean, I'm, I mean, it's pretty confusing how it actually works. Okay, now that we're here, we've got ourselves a little, uh, like, it, it looks like it's all the same, but it's actually different rooms. Uh, but they're all, like, four pathway rooms like this. So, if you want to see all the rooms, you just gotta keep going in linear directions such as this, and, uh, sort of plop yourself around. Uh, as you go, and I think there's a trinket coming up in a very, very similar section. Uh, oh, didn't mean to do that. I'm gonna go over here, because there is a shiny trinkets. And now I can start going over to the other side of the map. Yeah, it loops around again. <laughs> and oh, no, no, it's a dead end. Gotta look at all the rooms, even though they seem practically identical. <laughs> Okay, alright. Oh, no, no. Um, I'm gonna keep going this way. This is kind of a silly part, but it's it's necessary, I suppose. <laughs> uh, that leads to the next section. Oh, maybe I could... Oh, I should teleport out of here to get to those other rooms, actually. Uh, before I go into ye old final area, actually. I just said actually a lot of times there. Yeah, what I think I'm gonna do here is... Whoops, why did I go down here? That was stupid. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna teleport. Enter to teleport, and then I'm gonna go... Back to the ship. I'm gonna come back here a little bit later. First, I wanna get the uh, rooms that I missed out in the overworld, which are way over here. Keep going right, keep going right. 
Okay, we're getting we're through the rooms now. Just go straight up. Um, just love flying through space. It's so awesome. Uh, okay, can't go through there to get the other rooms. So gotta go this way and back up this way. Uh, what's this? Research notes. Our first breakthrough was a creation of the inversion plane, which creates a mirror dimension beyond a given event horizon. Oh, I've already found that. I did. Teleporter activated. But I don't need that now. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I should hit that checkpoint because death is down below. Okay, that's it. That's fine. Go straight down the center. And it loops, yeah, around like that. Alright. I've uncovered almost all the spots on the map. The rest of the spots are in the upper right corner there. Which I am leading to into that green area via that uh, other teleporter. I gotta dodge spikes to get back. Alright. Good, good. Everything is working out just fine. I hope. <laughs> Alright. Teleport back to there. There we go. And, and well, I'm just going to hard save, there we go. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part. Dance to the music. Invert to the music. Oh yeah. Rockin' out.